celebrated the arrest of the mafia boss and said that he was particularly proud of the very long and complicated investigation. This is the moment Italy's most wanted mafia boss was arrested by police on Monday. Matteo Messina Denaro was visiting a private hospital in the Sicilian capital Palermo. Military Police Major General Pasquale Angelo Santo. Today, January 16th, 2023, members of the Carabinieri's Special Operations Group and members of the Special Intervention Group and the Territorial Commands of the Sicily region, as part of investigations coordinated by the Public Prosecutor's Office of Palermo, arrested fugitive Matteo Messina Denaro inside a health facility where he had gone to undergo clinical therapies. He has been sentenced in absentia to a life term for his role in the 1992 murders of anti-mafia prosecutors Giovanni Falcone and Paolo Borsellino. He also faces a life sentence for his role in bomb attacks in Florence, Rome and Milan, which killed 10 people the following year. Messina De Naro, who comes from the small town of Castelvetrano near Trapani, is accused by prosecutors of being solely or jointly responsible for numerous other murders in the 1990s. In 1993, he helped organize the kidnapping of a 12-year-old boy, Giuseppe Di Matteo, in an attempt to dissuade his father from giving evidence against the mafia, prosecutors say. The boy was held in captivity for two years before he was strangled and his body dissolved in acid. Italian Prime Minister Giorgia Meloni said the arrest is a great victory for the state that shows it never gives up in the face of the mafia. We have not won the war. We have not defeated the mafia, but this battle was a key battle to win and it is a heavy blow to organized crime. Today is a historic day, a day of celebration. It's a day of celebration for good people, for the families of the victims of organized crime, because the sacrifice of so many heroes was not in vain, because someone picked up their legacy.